Hello, my group of achievers. My name is Mary and I'm here to help you with relocating to Canada through job offers. So today I want to show you something that is very, very interesting, something that will get you excited, something that will make your Canadian dream come true. If at all you are ready to put in the work because I know there are so many pathways that you can use to migrate to Canada, but for me, I am looking at the most applicable to most people, most applicable with uh, fewer financial responsibility. And for this, I'm talking about when you have to show proof of funds and when you have to do your IELTS exams. So if you're out there and proof of funds has been something that is giving you headache every day, every night, when you're thinking about your Canadian dream. If you are out there and you're having stress passing your IELTS exams, I am here for you. Today, I want to welcome you to a live stream that we are going to be doing on Saturday at 7 p.m. with somebody who has done this and who has relocated to Canada through a job offer without having to do the IELTS exams and without having to show the proof of funds. How did he manage to do this? Through a job offer. The only stressful situation that he did was to write a good resume, to write a good cover letter, and to write multiple number of applications. That one, I will not lie to you. You're gonna have to be writing a lot of applications for you to get that one job offer or three job offers that you will be considering. But the best part is that you only have to do this consistently for a few months. And then for the longest time, you're going to save yourself that 1 million 200 and 200k thousand for the Kenyan shilling. And uh, I don't know how much it is in Naira rupees or sedis. I don't know how much it is, but I know it's quite an amount. So if you're looking forward into going to Canada without having to show proof of funds, come learn with us. Let us learn from what this guy did, what this person did, how he wrote his resume, how he was able to win there and hiring manager's attention. I know there are so many pathways, there are so many practical ones, but not everything works for everyone. And this one will work for the majority of you, especially for you with unskilled uh, job opportunities. And finally, your Canadian dream is going to become a reality. Thank you so much for those of you who has been su subscribing to my channel, who have talked to me through comments, whom I have interacted, whom I have written professional resumes for. Thank you so much. We are still continuing with the rating, the resume. So if you want your resume to be written, to be, uh, you know, standardized in the most effective way, especially for a person who does not have access to the cyber or you maybe do not have access to a computer. You cannot be able to do it yourself. I am here to help you and it is not for much. It's just a few things just to say thank you. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I welcome you to the live stream on Saturday and I know that we are going to share good things that are going to help us relocate to Canada finally and fulfill our dream so subscribe share comment and share with that person whom you know has been looking for a job in canada and has not yet found it so until next time bye bye